Yo, what's up boys? Today I got you guys on a banger video. Today is gonna be about K Suave and Trippy Red. Something I can see them, you know, jumping on um, you know, around that area. It's gonna be a very, very, very fire video. You guys are going to enjoy this one. Let me know down below what you guys wanna see next. Also things that I can improve on, things like that. Cause you know, I kinda wanna um I kinda wanna be better, man. I wanna do like better things. Anyways, let's get around to the video. I'm gonna load up some serum.
that's cool. So this is why I'm, I'm going to turn it on uh, when the 808 hits over here. But I'm going to let it ease in a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead clone this um put this on its separate track and then I'm gonna put the extra 808 see how that sounds like Ooh. yo yo I think I'm going to do this. Uh, let's see if this even sounds right. <laughs> That's your like uh, homemade delay. To break it down one more time for you guys. Um, we basically started out with just three serums um, for sound. Really fire, bro. Like, honestly, this sound, like, carried <laughs> the melody, basically. You just want to find that one sound that, you know, you can be like, all right, this sound is going to carry this melody. But the effects that we put on it was Looperator. This is a little thing I just came up with. This is one of my effect chains. You know, got the filter on there, and then we got, like, a little loop effect right there. Then we just got to EQ, take out the lows, and take out the highs. And for our second sound, it's basically just a fox. Pretty simple. We just got gross beat. We got the one beat gate on. We got looperator through on the filter. And we got fruity delay. Really simple, simple effects. And lastly, we have this little lead. It only comes in at this point of the melody just to fill in the gaps. And there's you know no effects you don't need a ton of effects like that um but to manipulate the sound just go ahead and throw some looperator back tricks you could throw on portal you could throw on looperator you could throw on gross beat just experiment um shaper box too don't forget that another another fire plugin um but yeah those are pretty much my go-to for like manipulating like sounds then from there basically just render them out by hitting um all r and that's how we came about this uh, loop right here and Then from there we basically put this on stretch and we put it back on time and we just pitch it down So then for our second sound, um, this is more like kind of like an accent like a reverse type of accent All we did was you know made a duplicate of the sample Put it in reverse and we just literally just chopped it up together. It just sounds like this All right, so that's pretty much it for the beat. If you guys enjoyed it, let me know down below. I would really, really appreciate it. Um, hope you guys are having a good one. Be safe, uh, drink water, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.